today we're going to be making little chocolate cups. And, and we're also going to be making different flavors. And so the first step is to prepare your uh, muffin tins, the little ones here. So you want to take these tiny cookie crackers and just put them in as the bottom base. First step. Okay, so our first flavor or coloring that we're gonna be doing is white chocolate. So this is, I'm just melting the chocolate now. Here, white chocolate, and this is called double broiling. So you can do it this way or you can do it in the microwave, whatever you prefer. It just, if you do it here, you get a good consistency. So you can, so basically what we did is just, this is a pot with boiling water and then a glass bowl on top with this chocolate. So you can see it's nothing. And make sure you <clears throat> always have adult supervision because this is very hot. So just going to mix it. Okay, so now we're just um, getting ready to make the chocolate swirl. So now we're just melting the milk chocolate. Um, you can use um, you can use chocolate bars or chocolate chips. It's whatever you prefer. And make sure you have adult supervision as the surface is very hot. And we're almost ready. Okay, so now um, <clears throat> it's time to start putting your chocolate into these muffin um, muffin tins here. So you just want to take this is milk chocolate. So take like fill it halfway uh, because the other chocolate ah it's, it's really messy. Okay, cut. Okay, so now you're just gonna take your white chocolate and just put a dollop in. Okay, so now you're going to take some sort of straight object and just swirl it around. And it can be a bit hard to swirl it, so maybe just hold it down. Okay, so now we're just going to put them in the freezer for about 30 minutes. And now we're going to make our next flavor. So our next flavor is milk chocolate with peanut butter so always the milk chocolate first just want to get this one's a bit more like smooth the other one was not smooth majority of these are gonna be milk chocolate like first and then the peanut butter.
Okay, so now you we move on to the peanut butter step. Um, you can use um, um, either soft peanut butter or chunky peanut butter is your preference. Just put a dollop in each one. Okay, so next is the swirl stuff. So I'm using a chopstick or any straight edge. So now we're going to finish these up and put them in the freezer. Yeah, for another uh, half and half. Okay, so this is our finished product of the chocolate and white chocolate cups. We just took them out of the freezer. So let's now try we're them. Gonna try. Those are delicious. Make sure to wash your hands before you start any type of cooking and have adult supervision. Bye, see you next week.